In this problem, we're being asked to find the inverse Laplace transform of s over s squared plus 6. So this looks very, very similar to one of the formulas. Recall if you have the inverse Laplace transform of s over s squared plus k squared, you end up with cosine of kt. Really powerful formula. And you know, the way I memorize this is that cosine has the s. The one for sine has a k here. Um, so yeah, it works for me. So remember, cosine has the s. Okay, so this almost matches the formula. What's really missing is this 6. What we can do is we can take the 6 and write it like this. We can write it as the square root of 6 squared. What a clever trick, right? Because now you see that k is equal to the square root of 6. So this is equal to the cosine, just directly applying the formula, cosine of the square root of 6 times t. And that's actually it, right? So just a, a way to think about the number 6. Think of it as the square root of 6 squared. It meets this formula, it matches this formula. So just replace the k with the square root of 6, and you're good to go. I hope this video has been helpful to you in some way. Good luck.